Yonex updates the E-Zone 100 with a new isometric head shape and an updated hypermodulus graphite in the hoop and shaft for greater energy transfer, resulting in more power. Micro offset grommets allows the string bed to absorb unwanted vibrations. The new E-Zone 100 features a 6045 head size, 317 strong weight, a 33 centimeter balance, a 321 swing weight, and an open 16 times 19 string pattern. Our playtest has hit the new E-Zone 100 side by side with its 98 counterpart. Playtester Anthony enjoyed hitting with the new 100 so much he's made the switch to this racket. He switched to the E-Zone 100 because he likes the combination of control and power, which for him are the most important parts of the game. While testing the racket, Anthony felt he could control his strokes very well and place the ball to precise targets. Another positive part of the test was serving with the E-Zone 100. Anthony felt he was able to get more out of the racket, which gave him additional confidence when starting off the point. Our other playtester, Simone, found the E-Zone 100 to be more forgiving of the two rackets. Simone recommends the 100 for players seeking easy power and a larger sweet spot. All in all, our testers enjoyed the easy power of the E-Zone 100 from all areas of the court. The racket helped our testers generate solid pace on serves. The open string pattern offered plenty of bite for spin generation, allowing our testers to be aggressive on both first and second serves. The racket offered a slightly crisper response from the upper hoop, which nicely complemented the added power compared to the previous version. The same fast feel we've come to expect from the E-Zone racket line remains in this update. The racket was quick and easy to whip through contact for added spin and pace on ground strokes. At net, the racket felt well balanced, offering a blend of maneuverability and stability. With its all-round playability, the E-Zone 100 makes a great choice for singles and doubles players at the intermediate through advanced levels.